Here we are with the president of the team, Rojos del Águila de Veracruz. Uh, so, uh, Jose Antonio Mansur. Uh, sir, what can you tell us about the school in the Rojos del Águila? Uh, uh, how is the world? How are they working, progressing? Well, uh, it's been, for the last four years, we've been working uh, to develop uh, a new set of uh, kids. We believe in the talent that uh, there is in Mexico, throughout the country. We believe in the talent that, uh, that the state of Veracruz has. There's been, there has been a lot of great players like uh, Beto Avila. Veracruz has been known in the past for, uh, ha for being a, a state of, uh, of baseball. And with our governor, he's working towards promoting not only baseball, but soccer and all of the sports. And somehow it's a compromise with a, with a governor like we have, with Fidel Herrera, to develop uh, our team into uh, those brilliant decades that the team had uh, back in the 70s. These, the young, only way, these young players, what are they doing now? We're, 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 I'm, I'm, uh, I'm trying to uh, let them have the opportunity to be part of a major league organization. We have signed in the past uh, maybe 100 players from which right now there's been a lot, around 20, 20 players from our team that belong to a major league ball club. Like right? which ones? Well, we have uh, in the past like Sergio Garcia Moldova, which belonged to the Angels, Jose Orozco, uh, Rodolfo Aguirre that went to Pittsburgh, Jafet Amador, Roberto Espinosa with Pittsburgh. And right now we have a, a, an academy that uh, we're uh, sharing with the Drex Texas Rangers. There has been a good agreement, a good working relationship. The first time a major league ball club comes into Mexico and established an, an, an academy. We have 26, 27 young kids from the ages of uh, 15 to 18. Uh, probably this year, five of those kids will uh, go to the Texas Rangers organization. So in three years of work, we're going to reach maybe 20 players. 20 players that uh, has been exported or has been, have been given the chance to, to go to the States to play in, a, in, a, in, a, in one of those uh, organizations like Pittsburgh, like the Angels or now the Rangers. So we're very proud of the kids. Uh, it's been tough and for us it's a win-win situation. We win with the kids that go out of here. We win with the kids that uh, have been exposed to a, a, a better uh, uh, playing facility, to a better player experience. And more and more people, we hope, from the state of Veracruz will, will, will try to emigrate, will try to be uh, represent, uh, rep will try to represent Mexico in, in the big leagues, and soon maybe a couple of uh, guys from Veracruz will be in the big leagues. So this is a great example of the work you are doing here and the vision of our governor, Fidel Herrera Beltran. It's hard work. It's hard work because it takes time. It's a process that maybe it'll take uh, six, seven years for a player to develop, but it's the only way. It's the right way because then we have uh, uh, good kids that have been taken or had, to, had the opportunity to be part of a major league organization. And as I told you, with the Rangers right now, you know, there's 27 kids having fun, learning, and uh, having the experience of, 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 of a major league ball club behind them. Thank you. Thank you.